But what do we have left once we abandon the lie? Chaos. A gaping pit waiting to swallow us all. Chaos isn't a pit. Chaos is a ladder. So introspective and deep, right? I mean, absolutely. Just those hitting those cold notes right there. Hold on, chat. I almost was late. I was kind of late by like a minute, but I was almost like 15 minutes late. So I'm still kind of working on things. So uh, you're not the boss of me. All right. All right. Well, actually, in some form or fashion, you are the boss. But do not worry. I am here for you today on this happy hump day. Whoop, whoop. Yeah. Yes. Just Mirror with happy this. birthday. I appreciate you spending a little bit of your birthday here with us. Yes. We've already had some pre-stream love. Some countdown love, if you will. Mistress. All right. Kija or Mistress Kaija? With the follow and the Twitch Prime, I appreciate you. Starry Dance is here. Along with Darkheart, I appreciate you both for the follows. Dave Hammer already with the five gifted subs. Boom. Dave, it's a lot of support. I appreciate you. Draco Dragon 88. Nine months for Draco Dragon. Huh. What is your profile picture supposed to be? Uh, my profile picture on here, it's um, it's an echo drinking, drinking tea. Starry Dance says, wanted to thank you for the YouTube videos of your all achievement run. It has been great watching and I had to stop in to tell you I appreciate the work you put in and making those. Starry Dance, thank you very much. I appreciate that comment. I really appreciate it. Dave Hammer with the gifted sub to Merwiff celebrating the birthday today. What a great little birthday gift. Thank you, Dave. Darkheart says it's funny how many people can't say my name correctly, but I figured you'd get it right and you did. Look, like don't don't put me on that sort of pedestal. I butcher all the names. All right? All the names. If there's a name to be butchered, I do it. Zach, Zach, 72, Charlie, one. 72, C1. Mm -hmm. Two months. Happy two months. I'm here. Did I miss Echo getting more clothing? No, not yet. But we're going to see it. We're going to see it. How's everybody's midweek madness doing? A little hump day action here. I'm sipping on that Perrier. Yay! You know how we do. <laughs> Bricked Ed says, I'm pretty sure Echo got Ed wrong at least once. Whatever, Ed. Whatever, Ed. Gustavo Buxin with the two months as well. Grats on the lab cot, says Dreaming Kid soon. I mean, look, Clay's already called me a loser. All right. The week before, we unwrapped a shirt that says, for all those people who are not winners or something like that. And it was it was an eyeball or it was a finger to my eyeball. But then they totally redeemed themselves. Not totally. Mr. Rusty is correcting, saying it's the underdog shirt. Dave says, one year next month for a good number of us, August 20th. I wonder what my real Twitch anniversary is because Twitch is not going to recognize August 20th because it was, uh, I mean, in 2017, but we came back to Twitch on August 20th of last year. Starry Dance says, underdog e shirt. It's not an up dog shirt. <laughs> Mm 
Olivia25, that sounds is you. The yay? Yes. I have a button for it or I can just do it. Yay! yay! A deep river with a Twitch Prime, two months. Punk it in with some pie bitties. Nom, 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 nom. Mr. Rusty with a Twitch Prime. Thank you both. <laughs> Don Perrier says Quad Dragon. I like it. I like it. So everybody take a good, good look at the background. Everybody take a good look. We'll even go to, uh, we'll even go to starting soon for a second. Everybody see it? Because it's changing. Because <laughs> you know I don't, I, I don't, I don't do much for long, right? My stream setup will be moving, and I'm not 100% sure, I'm not 100% sure if we will have a Friday stream yet. Because of that, because of that said stream setup move thing. Ellie on Ellie, a.k.a. Ellie O'Nelly, with the four months. You know what I found out today, chat? Oh, you know what I found out today. You're not going to believe it. You just aren't going to believe it. Guess who's going to TwitchCon. Taco! Taco's going to TwitchCon! Taco is! And I was like, okay, well, I too need some tacos in my life, so I too am going to TwitchCon. Like 99%. I mean, I bought the tickets. Yeah, I found out on the Twitter. I found out on the Twitter because Taco's on the Twitter and I'm on the Twitter, so we tweeted. Tweet, tweet. Yay. Oh, yeah. Taco and I are going to bro it up. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. Olivia says, are you still going to play all the Star Wars games on stream? I never said I was going to play all the Star Wars games on stream. Anonymous. Who are you? You mysterious benefactor. Five gifted subs. These went to Starry Dance, Wild Kitten, Therm Helios, Rafa 2K5, and Miss Amanda. Is that music too loud? I'm kinda I'm wondering. Or is it just right? Is it is it hitting the soul? Because I'm not exactly sure. I'm listening to me right now. Most everybody says it's hitting just right. You know how we do around here. You know how we do. That's all we do. Aspect Tia Matt says I'm vibing. Hey oh! Oh, behave. Look. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah. It's funny because I think that has much different definitions depending on which the age bracket of who you ask. <laughs> we have some gifts today. We have some gifts. And once again, once again, names were not included. Like, I don't know how I need to stress. I need the names in my life. All right. First one, courtesy of the Amazon, the Prime. And the little note says, a gift for you, enjoy your gift. But it doesn't say who it's from, okay? So how am I supposed to show you my undying love and appreciation if you don't put your name in it? I need to update that thing that shows the address. Oh, ASMR. <laughs> Anonymous mailer too. I mean, it's something. Check this action out. You ready for this? I'm fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> it's a mouse pad. It's it's great. 
I think it's going to be more of like a, a bourbon koozie sort of sitter downer thing. It's absolutely great. Or maybe I hang it on the wall on the new setup. I mean, isn't that great? And it's so good. Like a giant coaster. Yes. A sitter downer thing. Yeah. Starry dance gets me. I think starry dance might be my, my soul animal. <laughs> Thank you to whoever sent that. Yeah, everybody's saying hang it. I think I will try to hang it. I will try to hang it. This next one came um, conspicuously wrapped with some lovely paper, right? But it was in there pretty good. But I, you know I like to put it back in, right? I like to put it back in to make sure everything's good and, you know, so the presentation is how it came to me. But you know I do check them to make sure. And I'm pretty sure I know what this is. I at least know that it's safe. Okay, it, it's a stuffy. Depending on whatever you guys call stuffies. I know a lot of people call them all sorts of things. But I'm gonna guess. Because my true spirit animal is the coca. That we've, get, we've just been gifted a coca. It's either that or a large squirrel. Okay, it's either that or a large squirrel. Oh my goodness. Look, look at this. Ah! But there's no note. I didn't even know that Coca's had little tails. Oh, it's adorbs. It's adorbs. We should take selfies together. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is definitely going in the stream setup right next to uh, Taco's sauce. Ed says stuffy 236. They use the tail to help stand on two paws, says alleged wallaby. If it is from stuffy, it's, it's kind of funny that it's a stuffy from stuffy. Oh, it's adorable. It's from a company called, oh, this is very, very Australian in, in nature. So I'm going to butcher this pronunciation. Okay. K-E-A-I art.com. Kaya art? Kaya art.com. And it says, hi, I'm a coca. <laughs> oh. Dreaming Kitsune says, if you take selfies together, you won't be able to tell who is who. Chat, that hype train completed level three, 13 sub gifts and 314 bits. Thank you all very much. Hello. Hello. It's a good quality stuffy too. Very good quality. Oh, stuffy is here. Thank you, Stuffy. I appreciate you. We're going to have lots of fun with this thing. We're going to have lots of fun. You're just randomly going to see random pictures. Randomly seeing random pictures. Yeah, that still works as a sentence of me and the coca. Like <laughs> at the beach, on the blanket, um, maybe in the bathtub with the coca wearing a little shower cap. <laughs> ah! Oh, we're gonna have some fun with that. Thank you very much, Stuffy. Oh, and the coca stands up by itself. All right, hold on, chat. Take it with you to TwitchCon and take photos. Oh my gosh, that is perfect, Queen. That is perfect. That is genius. All right, hold on. Uh, oh, uh, right here. Oh, temporary location, right? Oh, that's perfect. Perfect. Hot tub selfie, says Meriwith. Dreaming Kid Soon says it's missing its pouch. How else is it going to lose its babies? Do, do boy marsupials have pouches? This is a, an actual thing I just don't know. Chaos! 
Chaos! Boop. Alleged wallaby, our resident expert, um, says no, it's a male, no pouch. That's good to know. That is good to know. Learning, learning things new every day here, right? Mirwiff says, I own sugar gliders, which are marsupials, and they do not have pouches. So I'm assuming you're saying that because you own male sugar gliders. Yeah, okay. Yep. They just clarified. Echo Jr. <laughs> yes, we got to name the coca. I don't think it's Echo Jr. All right, let's see some, let's see some coca names. Let's see some names. Look at it. Look at it back there. Hanging out with Chester. <laughs> at Coca. At Coca. <laughs> Alleged Wallaby says the Coca is obviously named Eric. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Chad, happy hump day. Happy hump day. The queen says at coca. <laughs> Farico. I wonder if other countries have different names. You know how like in I guess in Spain they call dogs perros, right? Because that means dog and sparrow. But is there no other name for a coca considering they're only indigenous to one area? But there's still multiple languages, even in Australia. So there has to be other names for them, too. Right? Like, I'm thinking so? KGT says in Iraq we called chattel. It still needs an Echo Ridge Gaming staff t-shirt. Oh my goodness. How do I get that done? All right. I have to find like one of those American girl shirts, like a light American girl shirt, and then have it screen printed on the shirt. Alleged Wallaby says they do have a name in the indigenous languages, yes. The Haunted says also coca in German. Why not buy a doll's top? That's what American Girl is. Uh, American Girl is, a, is a, a brand of ridiculously expensive dolls. I mean, they're, they're stupid expensive. Um, but they are about, I, I would feel like that kind of size would shirt would, um, would actually fit that cocoa. Pumpkin says, I bought my dupes a few of those. Yeah. Little chick and sassy chick had some as well. And it's like, no, no, like go buy. What's the Target version? There's a Target version of the American Girl doll. It looks the exact same. Now, it doesn't have like all the, I guess, the accessories. It's probably the difference between a Toyota and a Lexus, okay? It's just a little fancier. Um, but these dolls, you can take them to an American Girl store and have lunch with them. You can give the doll a spa treatment where they get their hair done. Yeah. Okay. Raven Storm Frost says, call it Coco. Coco the Coca. <laughs> oh.
All right, Wikipedia's has got to be pulling my leg. It says, apparently in Norway, we call them coca or Kortholiwu wallaby. <laughs> oh. Mr. Rusty says, it's like the difference between a Louis Vuitton bag and a knockoff one. I could feel that. I could feel that. I guess the I guess the difference for me is for somebody to buy a Louis, Louis Vuitton bag, either as a gift or as um, for themselves. You know that's going into an adult that's going to cherish it, right? Here, here, this is my argument. Whereas the kid, not going to care. The kid is absolutely not going to care whether it's an American Girl doll or a Target doll. Sun Honey Sage says, name it Quirky. Quirky the Coca. Taco in the house. Oh, I'm going to get all those taco hugs. Oh, I'm going to hug that taco so hard. So hard. Ryak says, Cortala Wallaby literally translates to short hair wallaby. Taco in with the 500 bitties. Thank you, Taco. Can we get a uh, shout out to the man, the myth, the legend? Taco and I are going to be taking, um, we're going to be taking, it's the slash one now, Dave. Let me, here, I'll show you. Shout out. Uh, what? All right. Looks like somebody got it. Um, yeah, Taco and I are going to be taking all the selfies. Maybe we'll do the same sort of selfies with the coca. <laughs> oh man. Meduan says cocos will feed their children to predators to escape. We unpacked that whole thing. First time chatter, by the way. We unpacked that whole thing. Ed says hot tub Vegas stream with taco confirmed. Absolutely. I mean, while eating tacos. Taco says, did you get the TwitchCon party ticket too? Yes. I did. I did. I'm gonna have to set up a uh, like a, a a TwitchCon channel inside the Discord, just for everybody who is going to be going to sort of uh, at least drop it in there. Gallant Gabby says you came to Vegas and didn't take selfies with me. I was with a big group of people, Gabby. Hey guys, I know it's your anniversary and all, but I gotta bounce for a little bit to go say hi to Gabby. That would have flown real well. Davy Hud, 1978. I too was born in 1978. Somewhere within there. Hey there, I've been watching YouTube vids and I'm thoroughly enjoying. Thank you again for the great content and keep the vids coming. I doubt I'll... Oh! We've got too many gifted subs from Burger of the Ass. Hold on, Burger of the Ass. I doubt I'll watch live often as I don't like to screw up what I'm watching, but I'll occasionally drop up and use my prime sub. Thank you very much, Davey. Welcome. I appreciate you stopping by. Burger. Burger hitting it up with 10 gifted subs. That's a whole lot of gifted subarinos. Weazar said, Echo said a no-no word. I did, but it was by accident because I was yelling at Burger. Dave in with four, five more gifted subs. Thank you, Dave. Medellin says, yeah, I usually watch your vids and bots on YouTube. <laughs> the donkey word. Yes, it was the donkey word. I did not see the merch that was bought earlier. Let me go to my, my activity feed. I. Oh, where is it? Hold on. Because for some reason, 
Twitch's activity feed won't give me, um, won't tell me merch things. So when I, when I see everything, I can grab it and take my time to look at it. I don't have to sort of stare at the screen. Um, and of course my, there it is. Coachman9000, just wanted to show some support to my favorite creator by adding to my mug and hoodie collection addiction. Thank you, Coachman. I appreciate you. I hope you rock them out with your socks out. Okay, this one, this one's going to be tough. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go in there. First time chatter. I'm, I'm going to work it. Okay, alleged wallaby, have a great day at work. Cristiano Roberto, oh. Cristiano Roberto Hen Henches? Oh. Says, would love another series on hard with more limitations. Welcome, by the way, first time chatter, Cristiano. Apparently, Angry Forest is watching the VOD from home. All right, you guys ready? You guys ready for this uh, roll call? Davey Hud 1978 with the Twitch Prime as well. Taco says Eric is, or yeah, Echo is Bay. No, you're Bay. No, you're Bay. Taco says we need Echo Ridge Gaming Speedos for Vegas. Ah! Oh. I have a lot more working out to do before I put my in a speedo. <laughs> Remember, if you're new here and you want to be included in our wonderful roll call, where we show appreciation to everybody for spending their most valuable resource, and that would be their time. If you are not in a place in your life yet where you realize that your time is the most valuable resource give it some thought please give it some thought because it'll change the way you live it will absolutely change the way you live but if you want me to say your name in that said appreciation i just need you to say something in the last 15 minutes like hello or boop or present or coca or um hi taco you know hi taco works as well thumbs up yeah, let's do this. We'll start with one of our newer members here, Davy Hud 1978. Welcome, happy Wednesday. I hope your your week is chaos free. Dawnstar 782 is here. Dex 3D, leader of the Council of Meeps. Dave Hammer 2003 here with the gifted subs and a little bit of choo choo. Doff, Ed, 87 is here. Dreaming kid soon. Ilart, 22. I, too, am 22. Um, actually, yesterday. My 22nd birthday was here yesterday. Ellie on Ellie, a.k.a. Ellie O'Nelly is here. Gallon Gabby, looking for those Vegas hugs. Gustavo Buxen, Hanola SV. I am Goo. Infinity Eddie. Jacan Daraha. I'm sure I'm butchering that one. Janie Beans, just here to lurk 19. Man, my 19th birthday is coming up soon. Kenny Dave is here. KGTH, Kazarak, WPG. Kiri, 05. That's how many birthdays I've had since the streams counted. Kutai Ed is here. The man, the myth, the taco legend, Mr. Taco. Marquee, 1988. I'm going to go ahead and guess 1988, 88, maybe, possibly 1988 was the year Super Mario Brothers 2 came out. It might've been a couple years later. It's close. It's close. 
Master Cody, 432. Maxine. Maxine Evie is here. Max Headroom is here. Medellin. Mistress Kaiser, 96. <laughs> I see what you did there. Mocha Frappuccino. Mr. Rusty, 8684. Mr. Krabs, 4425. Old Man Wiki, Olivia, 25 is here. Oracle Smiles. Pumpkin of the Pie is here. Quad Dragon. Queen Calero. Raptor NC1. Happy Midweek Chaos to Raven Stormfrost. Rockos. Current leader of the Fall Guys leaderboard. Sampai Gemini. Slurp. Slight Quills is here. Starry Dance. Stomp him. Stuffy 236. Thank you again, Stuffy, for the amazing Coca. Sun Honey Sage. Tactical Crayon. Take a bite out of that cherry. The Haunted 318 is here. The Ryadoc. Twinkie 78. Whiteout. Who's feeding? Weazar. Wikipedia's. Wolfreg. Ryax. Merowith. Zach 72C1. All the way back up. Crypto Raider. Cristiano Roberto Henches. I'm still sure I'm mispronouncing that, but you know. Codeman 9000 in the house. Thanks again for the merch purchase. Burger of the Donkey is here. Donkey? Bunder Pressure. Bricked Ed is here. Bower Blade 1. Blockman. Blobby 16. Aspect Tiamat. And then headed off to work on this wonderful Wednesday. Alleged Wallaby. Cheers, mate. I bet you Wallaby, if they're lurking, maybe with just some audio, probably just cringed. The Queen's giving me a, a forward message, says Gustavo Bushin. It's funny how you pronounce Buxin. I say it more like Bushin. Well, now I know. It's either Bushin or Bushin. Current members are the leader of the Council of Meeps. Thank you, Ed. Because I, I haven't, I haven't, rec we haven't recognized them in a minute. Dex 3D, Captain Planet, Doff 87, Gilmore, Kenny Dave, A Squared, Kansas City Shuffle. I think the next one coming up is, uh, oh, I'm going to butcher the name. Weazar has, says, what does a guy have to do to join the council? You just got to keep providing great advice. I, it's it's a random sort of thing. Lady Wren 523. Lady Wren sounds like something out of a, a George R. R. Martin book. Lady Wren 523rd of her name. I just finished watching and following along to your beginner's guide for Ani and really enjoyed it. Love the videos you make. Thank you very much and welcome. I appreciate you. Maru Gamer says, no way, you are the guy of the tutorials on YouTube. I, I, I am that guy. Wait, how is Haunted not part of the council? They did like almost all of the Ani FAQ. Maybe it's because Haunted's just been more quiet here. Quad Dragon says, I bet Echo watched Thundercats, G.I. Joe, and Banana Man. You got two out of three correct. You got two out of three. But I've been told. I've been told by one Robert Paulson that two out of three ain't bad. <laughs> oh, that was a layered joke that almost no one's going to get. No one's going to get that one. Oh, oh, it was so good. <laughs> okay, some people did get it because Sam Pai Gem and I said I'm leaving. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> His name is Robert Paulson. Played by none other than the wonderful, wonderful Meatloaf. Oh. Oh man. I gotta look something up.
Yep. It was, I was trying to make sure I got the date or the year right. Last year, Meatloaf passed. Oh, it was one of those, you know how a lot of times with celebrity passings, especially you get these notifications and it's, you know, it's like, oh, that stinks, right? It's a thing. Uh, but every once in a while, a celebrity passing kind of hits you different. Meatloaf hit me different. So did um, um, Robin Williams. Robin Williams hit me as well. Kazrak says, love Meatloaf, Paradise by the Dashboard Light. Oh, such a classic. Absolutely. Such a classic. Taco got some travel. Air travel sucks. Plane been delayed two hours so far. Taco, my last trip that we just got back from, <laughs> I got delayed overnight. I feel you. The last two trips I've gone on, something catastrophic has happened. Well, I'm not going to say catastrophic like that because, you know, we safely got to the destination just a day later. Dave Hammer says, should we add the haunted to the council? No, not yet. Taco says, next time you're in the stream, ask about the meatloaf for Deem. Oh, absolutely. Don Star says, Robin Williams, my first real celebrity crush. I don't know what I enjoyed more. Like, I love the stand-ups, but some of the movies were just, they hit, right? Such a wide range with Robin Williams. And my dogs are going absolutely nutcakes. Olivia says, if you play Lego Star Wars, will it be on Friday? I'm not playing Lego Star Wars. <laughs> oh. Whiskey says, my first crush was the pink Power Rangers from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. <laughs> oh, Whiteout put one of them out there. Good morning. Good morning, Vietnam. Oh, that was so good. That was so good. Yeah, Kazrax is from Patch Adams to Mrs. Doubtfire. I mean, no doubt. Uh, and then um, Dead Poet Society. Goodwill Hunting. Like, I mean, seriously. Yeah, it's just, you know, it's a thing. It's a thing. Centennial Man. I don't remember Centennial Man. All right. Enough of the jabber jabber. Enough of the jabber jabber. It's time for some auction not included. I mean, it's, oh my gosh, it's been almost an hour. All right, chat. How long would you let me go? How long would you let me go just running my suck? Master MSC with the four months. Thanks for the Twitch Prime. It says, never gonna give you up. <laughs> oh. Okay, yeah, let's get going. Let's get going. Such it's so good chatting with you though, chat. Hi. Oxygen not included. Here we come. That's right. Yeah, there may also I gotta see because of the whole, you know, studio stream move thing. I'm gonna try to get a video out for Sunday. I just I can't promise you that it's gonna happen. Um, it's just, it's a little, uh, a little tough. It's a little, it's a little, uh, you know, it's one of those things. Let's do this. Thumbs up. Audio. Boop. There we go.
Whiskey, don't do it. I haven't set it up yet. I have not set it up, Whiskey. Do not do it. I'm going to do it. I haven't set it up yet. Okay? Ugh. Oh. Ed in with the drink redemption. Thank you, Ed. Cheers to you. Alleged Wallaby with the posture check as well. Whiskey wants a, a hype chat redemption for for a, a $17.76. And I need to do it. I just, I've been stupid busy. Big stretch. There it is. Thank you for the stretch redemption. All right, where are we? Where, why am I way up there? What was I playing? What was I playing last? Oh, some RimWorld. Look, Whiskey. Um, if you weren't, like, in college, in... Oh, you can't reclaim your name yet? Oh, no. Oh, I thought it was you couldn't change it, but for every six months. Or did somebody take Whiskey T. Fox when you were being silly? That is hilarious. If somebody took it. Mr. Rusty says, isn't it like 30 days? It's not supposed to be released for six months. Oh. Well, now you gotta think of a whole new name. When we left off in this wonderful, wonderful thing, we are slowly putting down the pip things. I think we're out of Arbor Acorns though. Oh, we have one more? Oh, I see you. I see you. I'm supposed to go there. They can't reach it, can they? Yes, they can. Or are we still playing dupe labor games? We might still be playing. Why isn't anybody getting the foods? Why are we not getting the feuds? Feuds? Feuds. <laughs> Some people know. Why? Seriously. Are we that? Okay, where are the priorities coming from? All right, we have one on the wheel. All right, we're finally getting it to it. Our Oxifern farm is doing decent. We can actually uncheck this now. Lenny Ed said it's 30 days to change your name and six months to change back to your previous one. You can change back, just not right away. Why is that? Like, if it's going to be 30 days to change your name, just let you change it back to the... Like, that's odd. Medulin says today is payphone, by the way. Oh. Do you delete your save after finishing the game? No, I do not, Infinity Eddie. No, I do not. What did we just finish up? I have no idea. Uh, I guess we could have clicked it, but I was too silly. Whiskey says it's 60 days, actually. Not that I've been counting. See? Chat, chat is always like different, different answers to the same question. I have like an errant here. A an errant hair somewhere on my nose. I'm scrolling chat just to make sure I didn't miss anything. I'm trying to get better at reading all the chats. It is somewhat difficult because we have a lot of said chatters. All right, that says five. This, let me put this on a six. They're not going to get that thing anytime soon. Uh, we do have our dirt in here. Why haven't you laid one yet? 29% for a sage hatchling. And we're going to leave the sage hatchling in here. 
Uh, is this not on pickled meal? Yes, it is, but apparently we're just leaving the pickled meal all willy-nilly out everywhere. All right, so it looks like we're on top of it a little. It looks like the labor is okay, that we're just barely behind on dupe labor. So I think it's about time to get duplicate number six. Right now we have one, two, three, four, five. Meal lice are our duplicates worth of meal lice planted. Let's get another one up. Yeah, attempts here are great for meal lice. So this will be duplicate number six that we'll be taking. Ed says you aren't even in a Mario costume. Look. Oh, we've talked about this? Okay. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Olivia asks, what part of us sees the sunlight first? Our eyeballs? I, I don't know. All right, this is good. Oh, that, that one's already planted. Already planted. So now we just have to wait. Do we have branches growing on this? This one is groomed, elderly, and hungry. So no, there's no branches yet. Oh, I see what's taking so long. It's the level four tasks here. I'm not sure. I, I, yeah, let's go. We're on double speed. We're about to be able to print a new dupe and point two cycles. One, this is five. Let's go with a nice little uh, stargazer cot right here. That'll be fine. And then we'll put down another thing here. And why is this stifled? Body temp, 19 degrees. I'm pretty sure we researched something that we need. So I'm going to go through and look at these. Hydroponic tiles, refrigerators maybe. I don't want to run refrigerators yet. It's not really worth it. I mean, the pickled meal is already going to last a long time. I mean, each pickled meal lasts for 50 cycles. Here we go. I mean, that Ellie is not bad. Oh, oh, but Ada is a cook. Ada is a good cook. Uh, I think it has to be Ada. I mean, Ellie is a really good farmer rancher. Um, but remember, we put. We Pete, we put <laughs> me punk pie into grilling just so we'd have a grill, a cook. We could skill scrub punk. Yeah, we're doing it. That's not a bad cook. Beautiful. All right. So for those who don't know how we do this, if you want to be able to name that duplicate, go down in your redemptions and purchase a, a little raffle ticket using your loyalty points, a.k.a. the Echoes. You can, you can buy as many raffles as you want. At the end of it, we roll a dice, and uh, that's who gets to do it. All the meanwhile, the economy stays nice. Huh? The economy just stays fresh. I need them to start going in here and getting more seeds, but that's going to take a little while. That's going to take a little while. In the meantime, they're going to be picking all these things up and setting them down. Let's go check the schedules. Uh, we'll put Ada on shift on Bishop, a bristle berry shift. We'll have to update those shift names once we get into oven food. Whiteout. Whiteout keeps buying raffles for Orange Woman. <laughs> oh, with Love Sparrow with a Twitch Prime. I 
I appreciate you. Oh, wait. Eight months for Sparrow. Eight months. It says eight months of greatness. I built my first volcano tamer today, and I credit your chaos with building up my Ani confidence to get there. Thank you so much, Sparrow. Unit. Oh, boy. Unit. Unit is gamer? Unit reminds me of Final Fantasy. But I think it's Unatus? Una Unatus Gamer with a Twitch Prime. Look, I'm butchering it all over the place. Una Tis Gamer. Ah. Oh, I had one of those. I had one of those. Those crushes on Una back in the day. Mm. Una, Una was Bay. I was definitely a Una guy. All right, so. Waiting for acorns is not going to do us any good. We need... We can now start wrangling up these little fellas. This is going to be good for eight. Pips. So I think we can just start doing like this. There's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The branches are coming in. So this little fellow should not be hungry for long. And then we'll also be able to add omelets. But... These should all say one, right? Yes. I don't have... Yeah, we need more research. We need some incubators. Lebimo returning chatter. Welcome back. I just looked at my supply closet and just now realized I have a payphone. Look, don't twist the knife. Don't twist it. Okay. Unitis Gamer says I made the name around 14 years ago. So yeah, it checks out. It checks out. It definitely checks out. Uh, we should probably end up putting one in here too, right? So we can copy here, here, and here so that they stay wild. Let me put the priority on these to six. That way they'll drop one, one, and one off of here. That works. What is this here? Chlorine vent. We need to find some more vents and geysers today. Uh, but we also need that oxygen stuff. We only have 200 kilos worth of algae left. Uh, that has to be a priority. That has to be a priority, like, right now. What do we have? Uh, as far as metals go. Iron and aluminum. Ugh. I mean, we could put the electrolyzer in here. The problem is, though, that auction would end up stifling these trees. It would definitely end up stifling these trees. So what do we do? Do we put it on the outside and then just circle? Yeah, I think that's what we do. We'll put the spawn on the outside of it and circle it through the cold to chill it back down. I think. We do have the water source down here. And we're going to have to break through here anyways because the teleporter is in there. Ugh, I don't know where to go. Probably here since it's already open. But I didn't want to put the... The spawn that close. Of course, this is all junky anyways. They're pumping water. Oh. Polluted water. Disable auto bottle. Where were they getting that polluted water from? And why did this little water get in here? Let's try taking care of that. By doing some of this. And you might be able to mop it up on top of the mesh tiles. 
Good call, Toph. I appreciate you. Research complete. Incubators. We have no refined metal yet. Because of course we don't. Let's start down that trail. Uh... I mean, might as well with the metal refinery. We have access to all this chill. This isn't sealed off by abyssalite either. It might be convenient to put it down in here. But if I did, it would dump all that carbon dioxide. Let's do that. We're going to go straight down. Carbon dioxide will still spill in here. Let me find a nice route. Something like that. This is all cold. This is in the base. So maybe this is the bottom of the base. So this is where we put the electrolyzer. I don't love it. I don't love it, Jack. Hmm. If your game wasn't Ani, what would you stream the most? Civilization. There's a lot of them. I have a lot of favorites. Maybe Magic the Gathering. Whiskey says they missed Civ days. Those were the good days. I do like Civ Days as well. I'd love to see, to see you play some Magic. Maybe we'll do a draft at the end of the stream. I don't know the current cards, but... Yeah. Heroes of Might and Magic? Oh, yes! I do love some heroes. I do love some Heroes of Might and Magic. Really disappointed that Age of Wonders didn't turn out as well as we had hoped. Like, that audience is dead. I was, the other night, I was taking a look, and there were 12 people, 12, watching. <laughs> watching. 12 people. And the whole category. All right, dupes, you're going to have to move faster. We need more algae. All right, there's a couple of pieces right here that we can steal. Kratos! I appreciate the lurk. Oh, there's more over here. Oh, it's in this caustic biome, though. Ew. Master Cody says, share the dumbest story you have. It depends on what you mean by dumbest story. Things that I've done that are dumb. All right, I think we're about good on this raffle. Let's check it out. Sunk full. No. Funk soul, brother. Pop out that reward queue. We have a total of 30. Master Cody, will you hit an exclamation roll space three zero? Good luck, everyone. I can't keep it up too long. All right, Dawnstar, hit an X up. Oh. Dawnstar hit an exclamation roll 30. Master Cody, we'll teach you the way. We will teach you the way. Dawnstar rolled a four. One, two, three, four. Of course it is. Of course it is. Congratulations, Whiteout. I'm, I'm kicking you for 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, man. 
orange woman it is. Orange woman. For those of you who don't know, my least favorite color of all the colors, the color that I have a certain amount of hatred towards, is orange. So that's why chat likes to name everything orange. Congratulations, Whiteout. All right, did we get a little bit of algae? Why didn't we dig that up? It must already be in there. Where's my... Okay, yeah. They've already churned through it, though. That 200 kilos did not last long. Maybe we should have grabbed the algae instead of the Atta. I forgot. Do you see orange? I do, unfortunately. Oh, algae! We'll take the algae. Mm -hmm. um, what's funny is grass looks orange to me. You know how when grass is really healthy and everybody says it's green? It looks orange to me. All right, so... Uh, I'd rather build it somewhere else, but we're just, we haven't expanded that far yet. Mayor Whiff says, birthday lurk. My cupcakes are ready. I may be back later. Thank you everyone so much for the birthday wishes. I hope the cupcake is wonderful. I hope it is wonderful. I don't want to dig too much of this out though, right? Because if we're going to be using this to cool down the oxygen. Hmm. But I don't know if this area here is tall enough. If this is truly the bottom of the base, I don't mind. But, like, it... Uh... Okay. They're digging through it. Let's start. Let's just start. Right? Something like this. Pl not plumbing. Not ventilation. Thank you very much. We have all the aluminum ores. Two, three, four, five, six. One on each side. There we go. Uh, we have 183 kilos worth of algae. We're doing great. We're definitely not going to run. We're definitely not going to run out of oxygen. Critus Pain loves... Uh, no, I do not love Clemson. That's the whole point. Ed? Oh, Ed. Where's the timeout button? Don't no. We don't we don't make jokes like that, Ed. Time out. How do how do I time you out for just like 30 seconds? Where's the stupid timeout? Whisper Oh, here it is. Here it is. Time out. Boom. Boom. Bye, Ed. Now how do I untime out, Ed? Can I un Can I untime out? <laughs> Oh, poor Ed. <sighs> the queen removed it. <laughs> How did you remove the timeout? I guess you just click on their name. No, you live with this decision, says Whiskey. <laughs> I don't like making people feel bad, and I didn't want Ed to feel bad. Ed's still my Ed, okay? Ed is still my Ed, even when they, when they throw Blasphemous. Blasphemy all over the channel. Alright, so this is going to be the temporary cooler. So maybe we just go in. Like this. How is that? Nice and chilly. And then it comes up here too. So yeah, I could bring them in and out through here. <laughs> Ed says 100% amused. No bad feels. Thank you, Ed. When's that store opening? Weazar? Weazar? I'll do it to you too. I need to ban that word. I'm going to ban Clemson. Um, how do I ban a word? 
ban? Ban. No, that's banning a person. Yeah, I'm going to figure it out after stream, and that word is not going to be able to be said inside the chat. It's going to be great. Yes! Thank you, Queen! But we have to add all the variants, too. We have to add all the variants, because people are going to try to get around it. When is it... When it isn't, like, 115 degrees in the attic... Oh, all, can you store? Can you store Legos that hot? Yeah, see, chat's giving you all the, the, the tips of what terms to add. Or is that dangerous? Ed says, yeah, that's fine. Huh. Um... This will be fine for now. No, we'll add a door for now. This is going to be over here. Whoop. Whoop. Now, are they going to be able to get down and up? Yes, from right here. Now, the doors are not a permanent facet, okay? This is just a... Uh, we keep the doors here just to be able to get in temporarily. And I'm doing it from both sides so dupes don't get trapped. Whiskey says, fine, chat. Everyone start hopping on the Georgia train instead. No, that's fine. Um, while I... Well, I des don't necessarily like Georgia because they are a rival. Um, I have respect for the team. You know? I have respect... R-E-S-P-E-C-T. So, yeah, there's that. Are you stuck? I I have the feels that you are stuck. Nope, you can still get up over here. Okay. Kratos says, roll tide! The only time I ever say roll tide is when they're playing Clemson. <laughs> Oh, college football season is... Oh, you are stuck. Oh, uh, okay. Can you get... Oh, no. And it... It's a pumpkin. Okay. Uh, is there igneous rock here? Oh, no. Okay, I thought... Look, I thought there was no tiles here. There's a little bit of oxygen, but I don't know if they're going to be able to get to it. Aluminum? Okay, so maybe an aluminum metal tile. It's a refined metal. What? An aluminum ore. Right here. Okay. This is okay. This is okay. Nope, we're not working on that right now. You are escaping with your life. Stop it! Why aren't you doing the thing? Double dork. Where's double dork? <laughs> They're right here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Nope. Where are you going? What? Nope. You need to start over here. Look, folks, everything's all right. No one's in danger, all right? No one's in danger. Woo! I mean, there would look to be some danger. Uh, Wiki's now in trouble. Why is all the things going bad? Wiki's now in trouble. All right, let's do this. Do this. Okay, just... Can they... This is ridiculous. This is what happens. Bunk it in with the 50 chaos biddies. Thank you very much. There we go. Now they can get down. 
they can get up to, and then they can get down. Ah! Ooh, I'll be here all night, folks. All night. All night long. All night. Just take a look at this. All night. Here we go. Something like that. Oh, that doesn't look right, but we'll fix that in a minute. Electrolyzer. Boop. 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 There we go. Why not ladder scaffolding? I mean, that that is smart, but we have not done that yet. We had the existing rows here, which is why it wasn't necessarily needed, but kind of needed now. Yes. It's all coming back. It's all coming back to me now. Look, Chad, I'm sorry. All right. Things are weird. I have all the squirrelies. There we go. It's it's looking decent. Martin Vidnav. Martin Vidnov? I don't know. First time chatter. Echo, I'm very happy to see you live here and not only on YouTube. I want to thank you for all the beautiful content on this interesting game. Thank you so much, Martin. I appreciate you. And coming in with a Twitch Prime. I appreciate you. Uh, you might not want to stay in there, Pip. It's going to get warm in here. But we're going to be able to keep it chilly with this wonderful thing here. Ooh, maybe... Yeah, we're going to have to bring the water in and cool everything using this. The question is, how are we going to get in? I want the entrance to be sort of here. But I don't want the carbon dioxide to fall out. If you if you catch me. So I want it to sort of sink here and then... I don't know. What if we made some sort of liquid lock out of it? So we come in here, we do something like this. And then we could put some liquid in there. So the carbon dioxide stays in here. I don't I don't know. I'm not 100% sure. We'll see. Were you suing, singing or quoting Ruby Rod? I do not know who Ruby Rod is. Apparently, I am not pop cultured enough. All right, so they're going to go in through here, and then we'll be able to tap that all on the floor. Tap that. Oh, Fifth Element. Now I see what you're saying. Clearly, you've never seen Fifth Element. No, I've seen it a hundred times. I didn't know that's where you... Why, why was the Ruby Rod reference there? Such a great movie. Such a great movie. Um, This can keep going up. And it looks like we will have enough room here. Uh, we're out of algae. So this is all the oxygen we have. Oh, another Arbor Acorn. We'll take it. Let me sweep it. Whoop. Sweep. Oh, I also need to get this stuff going. Oh, we need so many things. We need all the things right now. Priorities. I completely forgot to put Orange Woman into the grilling. Give them their little grilling hat. Double Dork. Double Dork carry improved tinkering. And electrical engineering. Um, I need an egg cracker. I don't even have... Yes, I do. We'll put the egg cracker right here. Now we also need some refined metals, which we're going to need for the Rodriguez anyways. Which means 
We have to build, where are you? Refinement. One of these rock crushers. Echo, if your age was how much money you had, how much money would you have? Nicely done. It was a good, it was a valiant effort. A valiant effort. Effort? A valiant effort. You know what I'm saying. Bunder pressure with the drink redemption. Posture check by Gravity Pegasus. Thank you. Actual age and mental age. Those are two different things. Those are definitely two different things. Mods, is there a, a mod out there that wants to do a pod prediction? Or a blueprint prediction, rather? Oh, and a big stretch. Thank you, Ed. Oh! Oh, I felt that one in my soul. Felt that one in my soul. Alright, this all has to go, too. We're gonna sweep this on a five. Uh, with this now doubled up, I can do this. I'll get rid of this one as well. That's got to go there. Now. We need large power transformers. Large power transformers. More than meets the eyes. Boom. Right there. Alright, so for those of you new, right about now, Funk Soul Brother, we are going to be doing these blueprints right here. And we're doing a prediction on it. So you can take all your echoes and, uh, you know, do a little echo gambling. Do you think it's going to be clothes? Do you think it's going to be drywall? Or do you think it's going to be something else? Um, no, I need the priorities. Ada has to start cooking. And... Yeah, that's fine. There they go. We're running really low on food, but they're getting it. They're getting it. They're handling it. Oh, first time chatter. Oh, who are you? Who are you? Ladies, gentlemen, nerds of all types. First time chatter, Clemson Orange is in the house. That is commitment, okay? That is commitment right there. They changed their username to get around my banned words. And then Kiri is just egging on said username by gifting them a tier one sub. First of all, Kiri, thank you. Second of all, Kiri, enjoy your 10 minute timeout. Third of all, Kiri, whatever. <laughs> Clemson Orange is subbed to the channel. Ugh. Captain Sud says, what word was banned? Clemson. The word Clemson was banned. Oh, oh, that's one reason why. I forgot to activate these little fellas. There we go. Ah. Oh. Now the question is, who is it? Let's see if we can tell. Oh no, it's a brand new account. Somebody created a brand new account. The account was created seven minutes ago. Oh, that's just... Mm-hmm. Yep. That's a thing. That's a thing. Have I been trolled? Yeah. Pretty much. Oh, the research is complete. And we need to get working on some of the metals. Uh, I guess aluminum. Sure. Let's do a quick 25. Clemson Orange. Wow. 
Max Headroom says, hey, Echo, what do you think of the movie A Clockwork Orange? Oh. Olivia says, what part of the USA sees the sun rise? The entire part. Sees it first? Um... I don't know. I It might be something like Guam. It might be one of those little islands. But I'm not 100% sure. One of my uh, good friends um, I used to work with was is Guamanian. And so I was also a Marine, so I know a lot about Guam. Stuffy is lurking. Bunda Presser says we have family there. Very cool. Um, they, I think that even their slogan. There's a slogan or something in Guam that says like um, the sun hits the U.S. first here or something like that. All right, this is good. This is good. I don't know what I'm waiting on. The research is complete. Okay, now they're, they're just starting now. This one got there. You can't... No, don't plant one there. You're going to mess up the feng shui. Which is good. We're going to be able to get another one. Clemson Orange 2. Oh, now they're coming out of the booth. Clemson Orange and Clemson Orange 2. Clemson Orange 2, first time chatter, says, I love your YouTube videos. Oh, what have I done to hurt you? Okay. What have I done to hurt you? Ed says it ticks me off that those who join the military from Guam don't get citizenship in the States. Um, I thought they did after a certain amount of time. There's even a uh, naturalization ceremony that happens on Paris Island. Paris Island is the East Coast, um, East Coast Marine Boot Camp. And there's a naturalization ceremony for it. Whiskey said it's not guaranteed nor automatic. Thank you, Whiskey. Yeah, that's, um... Yeah, that's not great. So, did they sweep that? I guess it's swept. Clemson Orange followed me. Like, this is only getting worse. This is only getting worse. <laughs> All right. What are we working on? Down here. I'm sure we have them now. Large power transformer. Right here and here. Battery right here. These gotta go over one. Boop. Boop. And then hydrogen generators. Start right there. It, uh... Ah, uh, it's too short. It's okay. It's okay. I'm fine. We're just going to bring it over in here. This is fine. Okay. This is fine. It's going to be another modified sort of set setup. I can put, this is not big enough. Yeah, this is going to be... Uh, we're going to duct tape this. I would say... Whiskey says there was a bill that proposed that simply let service members become citizens automatically. I would say at the end of an honorable enlistment, 
So let's say they did four years. I would agree. Because otherwise it would be it would be abused, right? And it could be abused for nefarious purposes. Nefarious. <laughs> oh, I don't know what's happening here. This is going to be the weirdest looking spawn ever. Because I'm going to need four hydrogen generators. But I guess they kind of fit right here. Oh, no. No, this is still okay. This is okay. Because I can put, I can put two here, and then I can put a battery and a thing here, and I can put two here. Yeah, but this is good. Blueprint time. All right, here we go. Here we go. Chat. This is, what, this is how we're going to do this. <sighs> Basic khaki gloves. They don't show dirt. I... Like, come on! Thanks, Clay. At least those are new. I'm pretty sure those are new. And then I can put... Hold on, is this... Oh, yeah, this is in the way, isn't it? This has got to go over one. Like this? No, because I have to be able to put... Like, there. I don't know. It's not great, chat. It's not great, but this is what you get when you're backing into a solution. That's three. Four. Ugh. I'm, fi I'm figuring it out. Okay, I'm figuring it out. Let's do it this way. Can I get three in here? You know what? Maybe I just do it wide. We have the battery. And then we have uh, one, two, three... Four. Actually, I can even make it look a little bit better. One. There. There. Yes. Yes. Boom. Solved it. Nailed it. Don't at me. Absolutely. Absolutely. Look at it. It looks so good ish. <laughs> uh, they are still probably working on the other things. What happened to my nice ladders? I guess I got rid of them. Oh, what, what is going on here? Echo, come on. Get it together. Boop. Yes. Now this isn't too bad. It's just got a different little top. Pendo says a full Rodriguez mutation. But it works. It works. It looks decent too. And it's... <gasps> It's not quite symmetrical, but it's okay. Boop. 
It's decent. If this is the center, right? This is taking 12 tiles. And this is taking 12 tiles. Man, it would be a lot better if I could scooch it over just a little bit, huh? Max says, perfect is the enemy of good enough. <laughs> 104,000 channel points. All to close. All right. Power. Here we go. So we're going to come out of this one here. It's going to go in here. Down through here. Perfect. We're probably really running. Now that I'm thinking about it, we're probably actually running out of oxygen right now. Yep, it's, uh, it's getting a little hairy. It's getting a little hairy. We need all the dupe labor, please. And some gas pipes. Absolutely. Can I go this way? Yes. And then out like this. Now, how are we going to get those chilled? I don't know yet, but we're going to work on it. For now, it's just going to be... Uh, what's that word? Slapdash? Haberdash. Slap snizzles. Slaps giving. Look, Jack, I told you I am not sane. I never expected or pretended to be sane. We could move everything over to the right one tile. I know. It's going to bother me, but it's okay. Haberdashery is a hat shop. That's so awesome. <laughs> How many slaps? How many slaps were included in the slap bet? Who remembers? This is good here. I, we don't even have... Uh, we don't have radiant liquid pipes, do we? Nope, they're right there, but we have to get them because... We're going to warm it up, and it's going to come through here, cooling all this, and then it's going to go into a desalinator somewhere up here, I guess. No, desalinator in here. Right? Hmm. Whiskey says, are you trying to say slapdash? I don't know. I said a bunch of them. Zolden says it ended up being something like 13 by the end of that fiasco. Such a good show. That's one of the few um, sitcoms I've literally seen every single episode. Most of them twice. Most of them I've seen twice. Uh, these can get replaced eventually as well. That can go... How cold is this still? Good, good, good. Um, and I suppose for now, since we only need one, oops, we'll just take this and send it up. So, like, right here. Alleged Wallaby just got invited to a brunch date. I thought you had to go to work. Like, how are you getting brunch dates at work? Like, how does this work? I have a good one. I hope it's an amazing brunch date. Or are we not talking about romantic date? Maybe, maybe Wallaby's not talking romantic. <laughs> they said... 
Gabby said they said they realized they didn't have to work today. Oh, that's great. Hurry up. I need you to work faster. Oh. Ooh, Drekos. We're grabbing Drekos just in case. We've had to have discovered them. Okay, yeah, right here. We'll do Drekos sometime this playthrough as well. Oh, I still can't mop that, can I? Orange. Ugla. Ugla. Orange. You glad I'm Clemson. Oh, first time chatter. Welcome. Orange, you glad I'm Clemson. Orange, you glad. Oh. Oh, wow. Almighty Bobino with the follow. I appreciate you. I also appreciate that you don't have the word Clemson in your name. Crown and Aces with the follow as well. Uh, research complete. What was that? Oh, that was our Radiant Liquid Pipes. All right, so the Radiant... Oh, we're going to need so much more aluminum. Are we really out of already out of aluminum? Aluminium. No, we have 12. Uh, that is there. Apparently, we have some acorns in here somewhere. There's one. Sweep it. There's another one. That one does not need to be swept. And then it goes down here. Why is there only three in there? And why didn't... I'm firing our rancher. Firing the rancher. We're supposed to have all the yummy omelets. I also need to get an incubator online, but it says we don't have any refined metal. I don't understand. Now it's saying we have zero aluminum. It just said we had 1,200. All right, another 25. Did they drop it somewhere? What had happened was... Metal refinery, there we are. Yeah, I'm actually curious on a poll. How many people were sitting around two hundo? There's my poll. Keep Echo off the poll. Do you play Magic the Gathering? Yes, currently. I used to. No. Two minutes with that pole. That makes me wonder. Because I used to I used to try to stream magic. It's got a great audience. It's fun because it's competitive and I love the competitive stuff. Why is the camera in stream math position? I moved it out of the way for um for the prediction. Where's the no, but my girlfriend does, says Gabby. Then um, that's not an option. You should try it one time on an off day. Yeah, but I like to see the numbers going from Ani in before I try something on an off day. I don't know. I have had the itch to play recently. TJB TV. Bzz, bzz. Welcome. What was my first Magic the Gathering edition? Um, the very beginning of fourth. I was around... I was playing when um, you could still buy packs of reserved. You could even, if you looked hard enough, still find beta. All right, we're still waiting, which means we still need aluminum is what we're waiting on. Okay, somebody asked for a story. I'll get you a story. I'll get you a story. Sometime in the, uh, around that era, 
I had joined boot camp. Oh, I had joined the Marine Corps. My ship date was in August. I was living with my girlfriend at the time. And so I had all my stuff at my girlfriend's house to include an excellent magic collection. Excellent magic collection. Uh-huh. My girlfriend decided, my girlfriend decided that she did not want to be my girlfriend while I was in the middle of boot camp. No kidding. Actually FedExed me the Dear John letter. I got a Dear John letter FedExed to me sitting on Paris Island. Okay. Not a big deal. Not a big deal, right? Like at the time, you know, I'm young. I'm going to have a lot of girlfriends. I don't mean that in a, in a, you know, in a chauvinistic sense, but rather, you know, I'm young. For those of you familiar with the game Magic the Gathering, um, I owned, I was a tournament level player. I was a decent tournament level player and had invested quite a bit of money, even quite a bit of money for those days. For instance, <laughs> I had a Mox. Specifically, I had a Mox Ruby. I owned probably 12 dual lands that are now going for $1,500 to $2,000 a piece. My entire, my one deck, my one deck by today's standard would be over 10 grand. Oh, this, this hurts the soul. This hurts the soul. I get back. And I go on uh, what they call boot leave. And all my stuff had been taken to my parents' house. You know what was missing? My entire rare box and that deck. Oh. I was so mad. I was so mad. I also, I was like, just Im oblivious, you know, because going through Marine Corps boot camp is, is sort of a, a life changing. Uh, situation <laughs> and I just realized this door was open so this pip was leaving um, so I was of the I was under the impression like oh you know I'm not going to have time or want to do all my wonderful nerdy things anymore because you know Marines deploy a lot and all that sort of thing man it wasn't six months later and I was like still raging about it the last druid, first time chatter, welcome. Just started playing this game and your videos help so much. Well, I appreciate you. Whiskey says all Marines do is nerdy stuff. I mean, you're not wrong. Uh, all right, so we finally have it in there. So now we can pop open well, with this one right here, right? So we have one acorn. And there's the one. Okay, so now back to this because oxygen is getting scarce. Why? I'm sitting here running my mouth. Hmm. Mandoin Branford with a Twitch Prime. Thank you very much. And welcome again to The Last Druid. I appreciate you stopping by. Four months for Mandoin. Yeah, I still get mad for things, little things like, um, yeah, you can go on eBay and buy a general amount of, say, fourth edition cards and stuff like that, but you're never going to be able to replace your collection. Uh, Dreaming Kitsune says, don't Marines LARP as soldiers. I think it's the other way around. 
Um, I need to get this going. Heavy watt, con not heavy watt conductive, heavy watt. Um, let's make it look smoother like this. Beautiful. Some automation. Oh, we don't even have the automation wires. Automation wires. Boop. Burger says, man, I know the feels. I had a first edition goblin deck. Not worth much, but it was my first deck. Yeah. Whiskey says, LARPing got banned at one of the bases I was stationed after a Marine sent a sword through a windshield. Like, yeah, you don't invite a Marine to LARP. Don't do that. Battery isn't connected to power. Thank you. All right. Oh, stop your belly aching. You're going to get oxygen soon. All right, uh, let's just flow this in now. It's going to be a giant mess, but we could use the uh, the oxygen down there, and we'll clean up the mess later. Now, the question is, how am I going to... Yep, just going to be like this. That's normal. Ooh. Algae, please. Nope. Spiffy overalls. Sign me up. That's actually not a bad meep. Researching, tidying, digging. That's a pretty good meep. Gustavo, I appreciate your, your lurk. Who's going to get the spiffy overalls? None other than RSSA Haunted. Marine Whiskey says, Marines take the every tool as a weapon concept to the extreme. That's right. We absolutely do. All right, so we did we finally finish this? Yes, we did. So this is going to go up and over here. And up and over here. All right. Good, good, good. Still missing some automation. Talking about cutting it. Atmo. Right there. No. Go away from me. That's the next one we need. Because it's going to tie in something like this and something like this. And... I guess like that. All right. So far, so far, so good. Now, to keep all this cold and to warm up the brine before we send it into a desalinator, we're going to have some pipes go like this, go like this. And we're out of aluminum again. 50. White out, welcome back. I need to put an unlurk command in. I have the lurk command, but sometimes it doesn't pop. The whiskey says I love them though. They're my favorite crayon eaters. I think you would have done well in the Marine Corps, whiskey. And if you know Marines, you know that's a huge compliment. Oh, this is cutting it close. Come on. All right, the battery's got a little juice. Thank you, queen. Can we do an at user instead? Because now it just looks like the bot saying I have returned. <laughs> Alright. This is going okay, but we still need the pipes. But the pipes can come secondary. What I need is to get these going. Why? Curious. Why isn't... 
All right, well, first of all, that's a reason. Why is this automation wire? Th okay. I'm confused right now. This is connected and providing power. Oh, it's because, because it's the, the wrong pump. It's only these two that actually have outputs and they can't get to them yet. So we need to do this. Whoop. I'll be a test. Haha, <laughs> Queen put command. Command! Critis says Marines, my second favorite sub branch of the Navy. <laughs> oh. oh, I love it. That's a good one. Touche. Touche. We also need to get this in here. How are we going to do this? Um, I guess the overflow will come out like that. Just like this. And this will be the overflow area here. And then this is going to go up. A little bit of storage. Absolutely. I mean, that's pretty sexy. And then we'll have a... Boop, boop, boop. Nope, that's ugly. Is this really the end? Well, that's kind of weird looking, but we'll do it. We will do it. Something like this. We can get rid of those. And the re we're going to put the overflow hydrogen generator in here, and we will tie it into into power into our main grid. But the question is we'll try it like that for now. Do <laughs> oh, chat. Chat, this is bad. Thank you, Queen. Nice job on the command. Why aren't they doing this? Colony lacks tier three? Oops. Oops. <laughs> Toff's message says it's containing spam and what their message was super duper hard digging. That's funny. Oh, here we go. I'm just going to deal with the breakage. In fact, is it actually almost? Nope. No, we still have a bunch of junk in here. So I think we'll just allow it to break. And we'll fix them. We have plenty of aluminum. Plenty. But I do still need all these going. That'll be enough to keep everything cool there. And then we'll bring the water... One insulated pipe. Some normal pipes. And then we'll need to do it here. Actually, nope. Cancel that. We can start like this. And then just go up like this. Right? And then this will head off to the desalinator system. Which is probably going to go somewhere around here because it's nice and chilly. I don't necessarily want the heat to be here. So maybe we'll go in somewhere up here. But 
We'll do that later. That's that's a side thing. I don't care how hot the oxygen right is right now. We just need more of it. Um, and I also need to get an incubator down, but we're still waiting on aluminum. Get it done, haunted. Get it done. If you dig out all of the cold there, it won't be so much cold. I'm going to leave the debris. We're not going to scoop up the debris, the debris, the debris, but that should be emanating cold for quite some time, especially considering it's in this sort of concave thing. I don't even have radiant gas pipes yet. This is just a... Eventually, there'll be a steam turbine cooling system right through here. But for now, this works. Yes. Yes. Get rid of the goodies. All right, what else is going on? Pick up a little bit of water. Not much, though. Oh, wait. We put that water there on purpose, didn't we? So it wouldn't off-gas? Am I misremembering? Maybe? No, no, no. Don't do that. I want to wait until the end game. And then it'll do it a lot. You see, chat? You don't really need oxygen. You just don't need it. Yeah. We're in the end game now, says Ed. <laughs> oh, I mean, you might not be wrong. Okay, okay. Something's happening. Uh, it looks like... I mean, things are happening right now. Okay, for the love of Pete... I need to put the automation things in. But right now, all the aluminum is being taken up. So what I need to do is cancel all this. Like that. There's one. There's two. There's three. You know what? I should probably keep this debris in here for a minute, shouldn't I? If I cancel all sweep... And I leave some of this... I mean, it's only 23 degrees, but it will absorb some temp. Give the crusher a light. That's a good idea. I wish the shine bug would just come around. Ooh, printing pod, yes? Mm. No. We'll take the salt water. Oxygen is flowing, okay? Oxygen is flowing. Uh, and I might as well do this for a minute as well. It's flowing-ish, okay? One, two, three. They can reach all that. They're just taking their sweet time. I mean, it's not a lot of air, but, you know, beggars can't be choosers. Beggars can't be choosy. What are we waiting on? Like, we still have power lines needing to go in. Kitsune, don't you have some other stuff to do? And they got the shine bug there, making it a lit workspace. I'm going to make this a six for now. We need that aluminum. Critus says, Marines are either chill, cool dudes that are smart or muscle heads that have to be reminded to breathe. I'll be honest. I'll be completely honest. Now, I am not trying to say that I am, you know, smart or... I am a smart guy. Okay, I'll, let me put it that way. I am a smart guy. So I understand when I'm talking to someone who's intelligent and someone who's not intelligent. 
the vast, vast, vast majority of Marines that I met in 22 years of service were intelligent, at least in some way. I mean, the food is on the way, so I have some time, says Kitsun. And I think it has to do something with the, I don't know, the why people do things the way they do them. All right, now we have a lot of hydrogen here. All this needs to get going real quick. So we're going to splurge it into there. Because now we're about to start pumping hydrogen everywhere. Let me disconnect that for a second. Pump it! Pump it! Funk soul, brother! Why aren't you pumping? Oh, because you have an automation thing. Whiskey says the only Marines I had a genuine concern about were motor T. Fair point. Fair point. All right. It's okay. It's okay if it breaks stuff. It's okay. Now let me get these in. Let me check out the other automation. Yeah, we need all this done as well. Uh, how do I change priorities while in this silliness? All right, that's good there. Um... I can also just connect that because I think this is stabilized ish. As long as we don't pump out too much oxygen, which we're not pumping out anything right now, that'll go in there. This is already 30 degrees. I will leave that one down like that. Yes. Yes, this has got to be set on 9060. Like, look, this is not the ideal way to build a spawn, but it worked. Beautiful. Mm. I don't know why. We must still be hurting bad for aluminum because of all those pipes that we were trying to put in. So I'm going to do like this for now. We'll get, we'll get caught up with the pipes here in a minute. But for now, this will work. Priest Zero with the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome to our humble abode here on the internets. D mood 89. Thank you for the follow as well. If you don't mind me asking, how did you discover our channel? Get it done. There's aluminum sitting on the ground. These are at 450 and above. Copy settings. Uh, that can go back in. in no one's in danger. Okay. D Mood says, hi, dude. Was looking for streamers for this game. Very cool. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. All right, this is working. I don't know if it's power... It should be, though. So let's separate it. It should be power positive now. Whoop. Whoop. Our overflow system is in. We'll have to put an emergency backup to this overflow. Something like this. So when this is too full... One... Two, three, they're gonna need ladders to be able to build this, unfortunately. Yes. 
I don't have that automation. I need the pipe sensor. Right here. Hey, hey, hey it's me, 3D. Two months. Happy two months. Welcome. Uh, I still, I, I kind of want to keep this in. It'll absorb some of the heat being generated. At least for a little while. This area is going to get warm real quick. We're going to need this cooling solution soon. But again, not a big deal right now. We only have six duplicates. And we can feed 10 off of this one line. So I'm not too, too killing concerned about it. But I do want to put that research in, or that, you know, that stuff. Right here. Well, chat. Oxygen. Check. That's how we do. Any more Arbor Acorns? No more Arbor Acorns. Oh, I know what I need. We need an incubator. We'll put one incubator here. So Pip Eggs take, what, 20 cycles? Wild? And so it's probably four cycles powered. I have eight. Well, one, two, three, four, five, six ranches to fill. That's 48. 48. So that is two powered plus two unpowered. That's a lot. Because each incubator power is going to be able to produce um, 20 pips, so 20, 40, and then each not, it's, this is actually five, so it's not shabby, but it's not great either. So that's what that's going to look like there. Your food is lacking? No, we got 10,000 calories. We're great. I mean, and look at all this beautiful oxygen now. <laughs> what do you mean makes 20 pips? So, if we do not power an incubator, this egg will naturally hatch in... It'll take 25 cycles. So, if you just put an egg in an incubator that's unpowered, in 25 cycles, it'll produce one. In another... 25 cycles, it'll produce two. And after 100 cycles, which is the age of the pip, it would give us four pips. In other words, it would replace four pips that were dying in all of these ranches. But if you power it, it can produce an egg in four cycles, which means, um, or actually five cycles, I think. Am I right with that? Is it four cycles or five cycles? <gasps> we'll take a look at it. But in that case, it is only 20 pips. It might be... Because it's going to improve it by 300%. Ugh. I'm not sure. But we'll get, we'll get that figured out. And that one can go here. Why aren't you kidding? Oh, you're on, not on all. Okay. All right, so this is already over-pressured here. Look how gorgeous. So gorgeous. All right, we really need this overflow system in because I am going to put a smart battery on this. Something like here. And it's going to say, hey, don't turn on unless we need it. Unless this tells us to. Which is this automation. Come on, right here. Gas pipe element sensor. If it detects any hydrogen in this line, it will turn on. And I think we can go... Can I go like this? Hmm. 
I want to say I've done this before and I can't. Because then the hydrogen's going to go the other way. So what we have to do is... I think I can do that, though. Unbreathable hydrogen. Yes! Build my little doopies! Buffer gate? Well, it shouldn't... It shouldn't actually get any of that hydrogen unless this line is backed up. 90, 60. And then we can actually get rid of the... Well, we don't want to get rid of the wheel. Oh, no. 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 Let me get in there. One little pipey. That should be able to reach. There we go. Come on, get in there. Yes. Hopefully that works. And now, no one's even going to have to run on the wheels. So the way this works here is, see how this is not burning hydrogen? Well, if it gets backed up all the way to this point, we have to burn some of that hydrogen. So when this bridge gets backed up, the hydrogen will bypass it, go into here, which will turn which will turn this green, which will turn the hydrogen generator on no matter what. Now I need an overflow for the overflow. Nope. I'm just burning it. I'm just burning it. Because eventually, it's not going to be an overflow, or it, it won't get backed up because we'll be using so much of the power. All right, chat. Let's check out this one more pod. Hatchling eggs, you say? Yeah, let me get some omelettes. Let me get some omelettes. Uh, no. I'll make the the thing sweep only if I do, because I don't want to grab this hatching egg. Because even though this hatch was supposed to give me a sage hatching egg, yeah. Come on. Oh, there it is. Food, food, egg cracker. Because I also need to start cracking those pip eggs. And I'll just start putting pips in here, here, here. We don't need them all yet, so I'm going to keep them unpowered for now. I think... Ooh! There's our cool slush geyser! Yay! Did we discover anything else? I don't think so. Oh, chat. We haven't identified it yet either. Are we ready for the game? Nope, that's not the right way. Here we go. Remember, no spoilers. Three, two, one. Is it a Coke event? All right, and then we'll put it on a six to remind me that I've already shown chat. I'm guessing it's a volcano. All right, this is good. I kind of wanted to make sure this is working, but. Oh, this is so nice. Look at all this wonderful oxygen. Mm. Mm. Echo zoom. Boom. Thank you, Slurp. All right, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to take a quick break. We are going to take a quick break, and we're going to see how many people leave when I tell them that, hey, when we come back from the bank, we're going to play a little bit of uh, Ox or Magic the Gathering, arena style. We'll probably do a draft, because I, while I have some historic decks right now, I don't have any current standard. Uh, so, yeah, we'll try it out. We'll see how it does on the numbers. Uh, but first, we're going to take a quick break. I need to get a screenshot here. Before Weazar loves at me or yells at me, um, maybe we call it awkward spawn. Awkward spawn it is. 
Boom. Boom. Alright, let me save this. And everybody said they enjoy the neon music instead of the BRI back, so we're gonna keep it on neon. Beautiful. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna take a quick break. I'm actually gonna launch into magic, make sure everything is good there. I'm, I'm probably gonna buy some of the gems so I can do a premium draft. Uh, that way we don't have to, you know, worry about it. But uh, we'll see. Make sure you stretch, get the hydration going. You know, go uh, shake the dew from your lily. You know what I'm saying? All right, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. 